Have you ever pet a horse before? From horses, scuba divers, to big trucks, to an obstacle course similar to what police officers train on, were just a few of the highlights of the 2018 York County Sheriff's Office National Night Out events. This is just uh, an opportunity for us all to get together the neighborhood watches in the community. We have a number of officers here that I would love for you to interact with. National Night Out is an annual community building campaign that promotes police, community partnerships, and neighborhood camaraderie to make our neighborhoods safer and more caring places to live. Locally, the Sheriff's Office had events in York, Rock Hill, Clover, and Fort Mill, joining more than 38 million neighbors and communities around the country. Donations from Pop's Pickle Stand oh, welcome to National Night Out. and Kona Ice brought a nice treat to the hot dogs and chips provided free of charge. And we're very supportive, my wife and I are very supportive of our law enforcement mm -hmm. and of our first responders. And for something like this that's happening throughout York County in the four areas, mm -hmm. we just decided let's get in the mix and we wanted to and we're here to help out today. Uh, shaved ice is what we do, but giving back is who we are. And so anytime we can give back to the community, we always like to do that, especially with the first responders. So we're glad to be here. The events were a great time to make sure citizens know what's going on with crime trends in their community. Uh, over the last two years, uh, our violent crime is trending down, our property crime is trending up, and our biggest property crime that we have uh, is breaking into people's vehicles. And it's surprising to me, we've had 71 firearms stolen out of vehicles this year. Mr. Jack Logan with Put the Guns Down Now, but, Young People, based out of Greenville, South Carolina, made the drive to York County's National Night Out events for two reasons. Well, I, I thought about one person, and that was Mike Doty. And after the tragic events that took place in January, where Detective Mike Doty was killed in the line of duty, Logan was one of the first to be in York County to show his support to the sheriff's office. How nice y'all was to me in appreciation of doing what I did that day. And I thought about the great people here in Rock Hill and, and hoping I would see a lot of kids here. Logan's mission to prevent gun violence by anyone, but mostly young people, brought free gun locks to hand out. We believe in the Second Amendment, but we are trying to keep kids safe from touching guns, educating them not to touch guns and pick up a gun until their parent have taught them the serious role of picking up a gun. Mm -hmm. and, but, but at the same time, we don't want to see people who are not supposed to be in possession with a gun mm -hmm. and using a gun with malice. Which upon hearing the statistics of guns being stolen out of cars, he has a message for everyone. Because if a person looking for a gun to go do malice right then, well then there it is, the other person might take it. And then not only that, they may take that gun to go sell for drugs, and then that gun will be passed on down the line. 2018 is the second year the York County Sheriff's Office participated in National Night Out events. So make plans now to come out in 2019 to meet the men and women who serve and protect this great county in which we live. Trent Ferris, YCSO News.